because prior to the printing press, nobody had a Bible to turn to. Alec Mattia, whom I love to quote, on one occasion writing in a commentary not on 1 Samuel, asks these questions. He says, Have we got a Bible in our hands? Let us prize it, read it, and commit the precious truths to heart and mind. It is not an inalienable possession. It may not be ours forever. And then he says, Is the Bible still preached in our church? Let us love to hear the Word of God. Let us be urgent to bring others in earshot of it. It is not our guaranteed privilege. The voice of the preacher could be silenced, and the truth of God is our only defense against error. 